everybody welcome back to my channel thank you all for clicking on this video if you are someone who enjoys talking about film how about clicking that subscribe button so with thanksgiving being tomorrow and friends being one of my favorite sitcoms of all time i thought it would be fun to go ahead and rank all of the thanksgiving episodes <laughs> So there are 10 seasons, but we really only have nine Thanksgiving episodes. Season two technically does not have a Thanksgiving episode. They do mention uh, Thanksgiving within the, I think it's episode eight or at nine. I can't remember exactly which episode it is. They do mention Thanksgiving. With that said, we're going to go ahead and start off with number 10, which would be season two, the non-Thanksgiving official episode, the one with the list. Roz is trying to decide to be with Julie or with Rachel and Chandler have a new fancy computer. He thought it would be fun to go ahead and make a spreadsheet between Julie and Rachel on who, sh you know, he should pick. So of course, that doesn't really go off very well. That's pretty much what's going on within this episode. We're going to go ahead and move on to number nine would be season four, the one with Chandler in the box. So Chandler actually ends up kissing Kathy, which is Joey's girlfriend at the time. Of course, Joey is not very happy about this because, of course, the bro code and is kind of like shunning Chandler and there is the talk of when the robbery was happening and he was stuck in the entertainment unit for six hours how he was come kind of thinking that so you know what there's a box so why shouldn't Chandler go in the box and just kind of think about what he did with Kathy and the feelings and all that good stuff and we also have a little situation with Monica she was doing something in the refrigerator ice kind of got in her eye and now her eyes kind of fucked up this is kind of a uh, post breakup with Richard but did you know it that the on-call doctor is Tim Richard's son. Of course, you know, she ends up inviting him to Thanksgiving because he has a very sad little lunch bag. So, of course, everybody besides Monica finds it to be like, ill, gross, icky. Monica's like, no, this not, whatever. So, we're gonna move on to number eight, which is season one, the one where the underdog got away. And of course, this is the very first season. We're still kind of uh, learning and loving these characters. Monica's very first Thanksgiving that she's doing because uh, Monica and Ross's parents decide to go out of town with their friends on some kind of tropical vacation. Rachel's trying to go to Aspen with the family to go. Trying to go skiing. Of course, is where we find out that Chandler does not like Thanksgiving. He boycotts Thanksgiving. He does not eat any kind of Thanksgiving food, which is kind of funny because you would think for somebody who doesn't like Thanksgiving, why are you taking part within the Thanksgiving festivities? Like, if I hated it, like, I would totally turn down the invitation to go to anybody's house or whatever. I would just kind of be stuck in within my house. But yet he hates it, but he's still part of it. Like, you know, he doesn't want to be left out, I guess, in a way. But, you know, he always gets his mac and cheese or whatever. But yeah, this is kind of where we get the very first Friends official Thanksgiving meal. And coming in at seventh place would be season 10. We just did season one. Now we're moving on to season 10, the one with the late Thanksgiving. Giving. Uh, Monica is like, I'm done with Thanksgiving cooking, doesn't want to do anything, doesn't feel like it's worth it. Of course, everybody's like, no, come on, we got to do this. Phoebe puts her into the competition within herself, which of course, you know, if you know the show, you know that Monica is very competitive. So the girls kind of have their own deal going on with trying to get Emma to a pageant because at this point it's when, of course, Rachel has Emma and trying to in uh, interest her into a beauty contest, a baby beauty contest, which is not creepy at all, right? The boys, minus Chandler, go to a, I think it's a hockey game. Everybody is basically an hour late to dinner and we get Joey's stare down of, trust me, subscribe. Moving on to number six, which will be season seven, the one where Chandler doesn't like dogs. What the heck is wrong with Chandler? So we have Phoebe who has snuck a dog in, Clunkers. Um, she is basically dog sitting for one of her friends. Chandler supposedly is deathly allergic to dogs. The truth comes out that he hates dogs because they're weird and they look at you, especially puppies, because they're needy and oh my god, what are they thinking? They're gonna attack you. Does that not scare you? But coming in in fifth place would be season nine, the one with Rachel's other sister. And this is where we meet Amy, who is portrayed by Christina Applegate. This is when she meets her niece, Emma, and I first thought, her, you know, she was a boy and called her Emmett and then calls her Emily. <laughs> it was a really fun episode to have her in. They kind of have like a whole fight. There's a whole plate situation 
from using the plates from Monica's wedding, the nice fancy china. May they rest in peace. And Amy also has a fabulous idea of whenever Ross and Rachel die that she gets to inherit Emma. And of course, we find out that no, not unofficially, they have already chosen Chandler and Monica. Joey's all like, who has the time for me to get the baby? So they're all fighting for Emma. So moving on to number four, which would be from season three, the one with the football. This episode, they're of course playing football after the game. They're like, you know what? Let's go have a little nice little fun game. They're very competitive within this episode. I mean, just generally, Monica herself is just super, super competitive. And honestly, I would want to be Rachel. I would want to be the one that goes along. Like, I just huddle up. And let me just run and me go run right over to go give me a damn pretzel uh, because I am not about that game life even though she did want to play but she sucks and I suck like I have no hand eye foot coordination I would fall I would trip I wouldn't get to the ball the ball would hit me in the face every time you would throw that ball at me it would hit me in the face because apparently I have no reflexes to put my freaking hands in front to stop a damn ball or like smack it out of my face area Let's get back over here, you guys. <laughs> Let's move on to number three, which would be season five, the one with all the Thanksgivings. Um, so in this episode, they're technically already done with their Thanksgiving dinner, and we're just kind of remembering the past Thanksgivings. I've said who had the worst one, and we find uh, this is where we see Chandler's tragic Thanksgiving of the parents getting divorced, and we're really trying to figure out what Monica's. Uh, worst Thanksgiving is. We do have Fat Monica in this one, and then we find out really what made her lose weight which is Chandler calling her fat and it's kind of like the revenge with sexy body there's like situations that happen body parts get kind of chopped off and this is where we get Chandler telling Monica that he loves her whilst she has a turkey on her head so it's like oh fun little memories of you know the stories to tell the children yes your father told me he loved me when I had a turkey on my head so almost there, number two would be season eight, the one with the rumor. This one is so much fun, you guys. This is where we do get Brad Pitt being a guest star. Of course, this is when him and Rachel were together for the breakup. So Will, who is portrayed by Brad Pitt, actually hates, hates uh, Rachel. Where Will actually hated Rachel so much, they actually made and by they I mean him and Ross <laughs> make the I hate Rachel Green Club and they ended up making a rumor that Rachel has both female and male genitalia coming in in first place what I consider to be the best Thanksgiving episode will be season six the one where Ross got high and in this episode he doesn't actually get high in this episode but Monica and Chandler are living together and they haven't told well Monica hasn't told her parents that they're together that they're living together because the parents turned out that they do not like Chandler because they think that Chandler got Ross high when in fact it was just Ross getting high by himself and he actually ended up blaming Chandler it's also when Rachel made that dessert the layered um it's a trifold or whatever the heck it's called with the jam and the bananas and the beef in there where everybody's like eating these desserts but like they're hating it except for of course uh Joey which is kind of funny because when she was telling the ingredients she he was all like mm, like he wasn't too sure about it but then he's all like yeah i love it now of course my list is not the right list it's just my list my own personal opinion so go ahead let me know down below how you guys rate the friends thanksgiving episodes if you don't want to do all nine we're just gonna go ahead and say nine you know what go ahead and give me your top five or just let me know which is your favorite overall thanksgiving episode i really hope you guys enjoyed this video again i thought it was a really fun video to do so with that said don't forget to give this video a like subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet don't forget to turn notification bell so you'll be notified each time that i post something new i hope everybody has a wonderful blessed safe thanksgiving enjoy your time with your family until next time i'll see you guys at concessions bye